Hi there everyone, welcome to the Mac Essentials. In this video, I will be talking about, let's say you have installed an app and you want to delete it. How we can delete that? And before I show you, if you are new to this channel and want to elevate your experience with Macintosh, then please make sure you subscribe to the Mac Essentials as we keep on bringing topics like this related to Mac OS and its productivity. Okay, so now let me actually go down here so that I can assess my dock. Now let me click here on launchpad and let's say there is a program that you would like to delete for example this one okay so I'm gonna talk about not even one or two three different method how you can delete those apps that are of no use for you so first method is all we need to do just like the way we do in let's say iPhone simply place your cursor over the app that you want to delete and keep pressing left mouse button and you will see that the app will dance again just like what we see in case of iPhone but in this particular case since I do not have downloaded this app from Apple App Store I do not see the cross button okay so I may not able to delete this particular one but uh, those apps that are available in App Store uh, you may able to delete those for example uh, let's say I want to delete uh, this better snap tool so let me click on it and now click delete and in this way I have deleted this app so this particular method is not applicable for all the apps as you can see it here as well now maybe it already have worked for you or let's say it did not then you can use method number two which is uh, by visiting desktop and simply make a click here such that you see finder here in menu list now let's click on go and let's go to apps and now from here also uh, the app that I wanted to delete was obsidian so let me select it and now if I go down here uh, what we need to do is we need to you know simply drag it and place it in our recycle bin so here now you can see I have moved obsidian to recycle bin so in this way guys we can delete apps that we were not able to delete by method number one now you might have seen in case of let's say word excel and powerpoint they also do not have uh, the cross sign as you can see here again but now with method number two you can easily delete them simply select the app and then make a right click click on move to trash it is that easy guys so in this way we can move those apps or again you know I mean all we need to do is we need to select the app that I want to delete and then simply keep pressing your left mouse button and drop it to the trash now here you need to enter your password so in this way also you can delete the app but there is one challenge with both these cases and the challenge is whenever we delete apps like this there is a still certain residue file that stay in your space and consume system space so in order to mitigate that we should perform deep cleaning or deep deletion that you can easily achieve using one software known as app cleaner so let me type here app cleaner and then I'm gonna say Mac download and now let's click here and now uh, what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna click on this link and there we go so we have simply downloaded it and let me open this and let's try to install it so let me click on this app cleaner and there we go so here i can see the apple icon now after extracting let's double click on it and click on open now here oh, what we need to do is uh, we simply need to drop our apps here okay probably what i'm gonna do here is i'm gonna place it here and now all we need to do is uh, using this third method is we need to drop the app that we would like to delete uh, from here to here okay so let me click on this and there we go so as soon as I put it here here you can see it was easily identified now all I need to do is I need to click on remove but that particular app was a chrome extension that I do not want to delete and now all I need to do is I need to drag the app that I want to delete to app cleaner and now app cleaner will come into picture and there we go so here we can see there are multiple multiple file attached to that particular thing now all I need to do is I need to click on 
remove and then here I need to enter my password now in order to fix this kind of problem now what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna go to launchpad and let's say uh, this is the app that I want to delete so I'm gonna hold it and then I'm gonna take this to app cleaner and let's drop it here now let's click here on app cleaner and here we see that the app cleaner shows this error which is cannot remove protected apps and we can choose which app are protected in preferences so here we need to change some settings in preferences so let's click here preferences and now we need to uncheck this option which says show protected apps okay and we can also uncheck protect running app now let's close it and again let's go here launchpad select the app again drop it to this app cleaner now i'm gonna click here and then here you can see the app cleaner is not only deleting the app but it is very smart enough to detect all related files so here there is one other setting file or plist file that exists in this location so sometimes what happens is if we're going to delete these apps by going in app folder or you know from launchpad you may be not deleting this left over and that sometimes cause issue so let me now click on remove and in this way guys we can get rid of not only app but also their software data so i'm not talking about something that you have created out of it for example let's say you want to delete microsoft word but you do not want to delete the document that you have created uh, using microsoft word so this app understand that and it will only delete microsoft word related package it won't be deleting the document that you have created out of it so i hope you understood what i want to say and that's all guys from my side in this video and i hope guys you find this video helpful and informational if so then please do like and subscribe to the mac essential where we want to elevate your macintosh experience and i will catch you soon with one such another video till then you take care and bye bye